This is an example solution for one of the angle of incidence, angle of refraction practice problems from sciencepimer.com. The question we have is, light travels from diamond into fiber optic cable with an angle of refraction of 73 degrees. Given this, what is the angle of incidence if the refractive index of diamond is 2.4 and the refractive index of fiber optic cable is 1.6? With all these problems, the best place to start is with the equation for Snell's law, which is the sine of the angle of incidence over the sine for the angle of refraction equals the refractive index of the refracted medium over the refractive index of the incident medium. As a reminder of the notation used here, theta is used to indicate the angles and n is used for the refractive indexes. So theta i is the angle of incidence, theta r is the angle of refraction, n r is the refractive index of the refracted medium, and n i is the in refractive index of the incident medium. Now given this, we find which of the variables in this equation we are trying to solve. In this case, it is the angle of incidence. So we need to take Snell's law equation and solve it for the angle of incidence. So the first step is to move the sine of the angle of refraction to the other side. So if we multiply both sides by sine theta r, we end up with sine theta r times the refractive index of the refracted medium over the refracted index of the incident medium equals sine theta i. Now, we then take the inverse sine of both sides to get the sine away from the variable we're trying to solve for. So if we take the inverse sine, we get theta i equals the inverse sine of everything else on the other side of the equation. Now we have the problem solved for the variable we're trying to find. The next step is to plug all the other variables into this equation. So we'll start with a clean slate with our equation solved for the variable we're trying to find. And we'll go up into the problem to figure out how to fill out the other side of the equation. The first thing to see is that the light is traveling from the diamond into the fiber optic cable. This means the incident material is the diamond, so the refractive index of the incident material is 2.4. The refractive index of the refracted medium, the cable, is 1.6, as given in the question. We're also told that the angle of refraction is 73 degrees. So all we have to do is plug these numbers into our equation solved for the angle of incidence, and then solve the problem. So we have sine of 73 degrees times 1.6 divided by 2.4. And then if we take the inverse sine of all of that, we should get our answer. The first step will be to find the sine of 73 degrees. So we'll pull a calculator in. The sine of 73 degrees, the sine of 73 degrees is 0 0.956. Put this into the equation. Fill out the rest of it, so it's 0 0.956 times 1.6 divided by 2.4. Pull the calculator back in, 0 0.956 times 1.6 divided by 2.4 gives us 0 0.63. So now we have the inverse sine of 0 0.638. Go ahead and take the inverse sine of that, we get 39.6. So the angle of incidence from this problem equals 39.6 degrees. Switch back to the website, put 39.6 degrees. We're asked to give to the answer to the nearest tenth of degree. So 39.6 is what we want. We submit the answer and we find out that that is correct.